Hey, it's Derek, and this is Plobal explained in five minutes or less. Let's go. What is it? Plobal is a white label mobile app development and launch tool for digitally native vertical brands, the DNVBs for short, that combines an easy to use technology with a team of dedicated service managers to ensure each customer of theirs is able to launch their own iOS and Android apps and drive more revenue through those branded apps. Think of your mobile app as a new sales channel to acquire and retain customers through. Purchasing through a mobile app has proven increase in conversion rate, ROI, and lifetime value. Plobal integrates with Shopify to pull in all of the product and collection data so that you can drag and drop collections and products directly into your mobile app and have it up and running within a day. Plobal also integrates with CleverTap, which is a leading mobile app analytics and marketing automation tool, which makes it very easy to track and segment users in the behavior. Perfect for marketing to your customers and users at a later time and understanding how people are using the mobile app so you can adjust collections and products and so forth. Competitive landscape. Plobal's main competitor is Tapcart, which is very comparable in feature set, but a more of a do-it-yourself solution than Plobal's enterprise all-hands-on-deck approach. Tapcart seems to have a little bit more in the way of a mobile app push notification component, but Plobal has gone and created their own tool called Installify for better helping you convert people from mobile web into app downloads and then mobile app users. And Tapcart simply just has a featured banner that helps with this. Biggest differentiator. Plobal is tech with the opportunity for managed services on top for larger accounts. This makes it easier to handle custom development and integration work that may be required for larger brands. For that reason, I would say Plobal is positioned more as the enterprise solution as a mobile app tech provider. They have more advanced app analytics through their CleverTap integration, and they partner with LimeSpot for embedded AI product recommendations within the app, something that Tapcart currently does not have. Metric impact. Plobal looks to increase your mobile conversion rate, which will also have an impact on lowering your cost of customer acquisition. They also expect the app to increase retention, repeat purchases, and therefore lifetime value. So while this is a retention tool, it can be used as an acquisition tool simultaneously. It works on both sides. Bottom line, Plobal believes they can increase mobile conversion rates by up to 300%. You can do the math on how you think that will affect your revenue, your cost per acquisition, etc. I do believe that this is slightly a little bit of a correlation, not causation, meaning people that download the app are already more likely to buy. So that's why you see a higher conversion rate on your mobile app. Drawbacks. They don't have the cool GIF animation push notifications that Tapcart has. They don't have Tapcart's augmented reality functionality, which is really cool, but also tough to implement. And not a lot of people are going to be using that. And it looks like they're more reliant on their partners like CleverTap, PushOwl, and LimeSpot for integration functionality instead of what we see on the other side is more of implementing and building out the feature sets in-house themselves. That could be a pro or con depending on your tech stack and budget and costs could go either way. When should you use it? Deciding to invest in a mobile app is best for relatively established brands. Like I said, a digitally native vertical brand, DNVB, which cares about keeping customers forever for life, increasing retention rates, increasing lifetime value, and providing a differentiated experience. Given that Plobal is more of the enterprise solution over Tapcart, you should be more apt to go with them if you need custom tools or integrations, you have a complicated tech stack, you have a larger brand and solid traffic, and you need the managed service component on top of the technology. Smaller brands can absolutely still go with Plobal, but something tells me their pricing is going to be a little bit higher than Tapcart as an alternative. When shouldn't you use it? This certainly shouldn't be a focus if you're a small store. If you don't get repeat purchases, if you don't have a brand, if you aren't doing a lot of sales on mobile already, and if you don't have the time to adjust your marketing strategy to make the mobile app fit into the mix. Integrations. Obviously, you have a ro robust Shopify integration here that makes everything work. Plobal pulls in the inventory data from Shopify and uses Shopify checkout process from within the mobile branded app. So there won't be a lot changing from your inventory management side. They also integrate with CleverTap for app analytics, PushOwl for web push notifications that can also drive app downloads, among other things. 
LimeSpot for in-app AI-driven product recommendations, Searchinize for improved in-app search, and Bold Options for those currently using Bold Options on-site. You can actually do that within app for things like choosing sizes, colors, and more advanced choice options that you may have. Pricing. Pricing starts at $99 a month for one branded app, but I'm not really sure when you would just buy iOS and not Android as well. It doesn't make a lot of sense. So for that reason, I think it realistically starts at $199 a month, but the $299 plan includes the Facebook SDK, which is really where you're probably gonna wanna start off with. It goes all the way up to their enterprise solution at $12.99 a month, which is most likely their best fit uh, pricing plan. So if you can afford the $12.99 a month plan, Plobal is a good fit for you. If that seems like a lot, then you're probably looking at choosing their competitor tap card. Setup time and resources. It should only take a few hours to set up as long as you have some image and GIF resources on hand. Otherwise, you may have to hire a designer for some of that. Plobal can help you with more technical components like ensuring your Facebook SDK and events are set up and integrated, being sent back to your data warehouse and stuff like that, and making sure that segmentation and app analyticals are set up and working. After that, it's on you to decide how to drive traffic to the app and how to incentivize users and customers to download the app. Uh, use the app and purchase from within the app. It's worth noting that it takes a few days to submit and get apps approved in both iOS and Android. So even after the app is set up, there is about a week of downtime while you're waiting for approval. Final thoughts. Every digitally native vertical brand should have a mobile app experience and it should be tied closely together with their loyalty and retention strategies. Creating a clean branded experience on mobile and getting customers stoked to come back and buy from you again and again that's the name of the game. That's how we win as e-commerce stores. Plobal is the market leader for e-commerce and Shopify stores in launching mobile apps. They have the most integrations, the most features. That's Plobal apps in five minutes or less. If you're thinking about trying out Plobal, you can click the link below. If you have any additional questions on how Plobal apps might fit into your overall marketing strategy and toolbox, you can feel free to book a forever free consultation with me, Derek Haney. There should be a link somewhere around here. And I really hope you enjoyed this video. 